15 garden bench ideas for your backyard. Where do old park benches go when they get replaced by updated models? This homeowner in Santa Monica, California, found a spot in her front garden that blended in with the landscape and provides a quick resting place while working on the vegetables and other front yard crops. For those who know what they are looking at, the bench is a nostalgic reminder of the past. In a large formal garden, an elegant bench with matching tables nestles into the perfectly manicured shrubs. A teal bench cushion complements, rather than competes, with the nearby greenery, and makes a beautiful place to sit, enjoy tea, visitors, and the pond that is in front of it. A low brick wall with some missing pieces is perfect for a game of hide and seek or peekaboo. The low bench is just asking for the kid to climb on it and peer over the wall, into the rest of the garden. This landscape was cleverly designed with children's curiosity in mind. Wood Slat Bench, a popular project featured in mid-20th century how-to books and magazines, gets an updated look with a backrest, paint, and a small umbrella. The bench is situated along a pathway, which is a good place to escape or contemplate projects in the immediate vicinity. It doesn't get much more basic or clever than this wood plank bench with two similar sized rocks to support it. Just make sure the rocks are spaced as supports and won't give a seesaw or teeter-totter experience for anyone who sits on it. A gleaming warm wood deck seamlessly extends indoor space to the outdoors at the Southern California home. A simple wooden bench on chrome legs is aligned with the edge of the deck and the distressed wood fence behind it, simple yet elegant. Two wagon wheels become the arms and supports for this rustic western-style bench that's perfect for a yard that features cacti, succulents, and drought-tolerant landscaping. An arbor-covered bench can be tucked in a corner, used as a way to delineate or divide parts of a yard, or as a focal point and place to rest near a pool or on a deck. Soften it by planting vines nearby or in containers, climbing roses would be pretty and also add a sweet scent to whoever is sitting on the bench. A simple, low bench against the wall of an outdoor shower area allows the person rinsing off to put his per clothes, swimsuit or personal gear to the side while quickly showering off. The bench is almost strictly utilitarian and works perfectly in this setting. Ice Studio's pebbles are a lively, human-sized, pebble-shaped take on the typical backless bench. Pebbles are made in fiberglass, wood, fabric or cast stone. The studio is based in Venice, California, and the seats have been featured at top design shows and events, including the annual Dwell on Design in Los Angeles. Instead of a water-guzzling lawn, people who still need to have a touch of green grass can get their fix, and sit on it, too. While this isn't exactly the type of bench that invites you to sit for hours, it makes a fine conversation piece, focal point and adds a touch of fun to a landscape. It might not be comfortable for swimsuit-wearing guests, however, since grass has a reputation for being itchy on bare skin. This is an authentic cast-iron Victorian bench, once owned by the late pop star Michael Jackson. The bench was part of a vast collection of outdoor statues and furniture that decorated the grounds of his Neverland estate near Santa Barbara, California. Placed under a tree off the beaten path a wooden bench can be a place for quiet reflection, an escape, or reading. Sometimes something as ordinary as a garden bench can be a work of art, like a vibrant painting or sculpture for an outdoor living space. This colorful assemblage mixed-media bench can be found at the San Diego Botanical Garden in Encinitas, California. If you're feeling ambitious and have some talent, why not make a piece of art that you can sit on? Other possible materials include acrylic paint or mosaic tiles. An unassuming narrow bench that is slightly weathered can find a new purpose as a low shelf or table of displaying potted plants, or, in this case, outdoor terrarium gardens. Not to encourage you to hang on to something you may not want anymore, but it never hurts to look at something in the yard with a fresh perspective and the possibility of repurposing, before it ends up in a landfill. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more interesting videos.
and please hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm.